The statewide Amber Alert we were all following comes to an end inside a Tiedemann Road business. Police tell me that Pammy May was found inside Senveo, frantic, disheveled, asking for someone to call her husband. The responding officers identified the woman as Pammy May and took her into custody without incident. She was subsequently transported to a local hospital in the Cleveland area for medical treatment. Senveo is an envelope manufacturer. Linda Santa lives right next door on Tiedemann Road. It's really kind of terrifying. Santa took me to her backyard, a wooded area right next to the business where May was found. She wanted to check on her property. Does it look out of place to you at all right now? No, that would be so crazy thinking that she could have been that close. On Wednesday, we showed you where the car May was reportedly driving was found. It was left at an apartment complex called Parkview Estates. To give you some context, that is a three minute drive from Senveo or about a 13 minute walk. Had you heard about the Amber Alert? Did you think about the Amber Alert at that time? No, I, did, I didn't know about it. On Thursday, police reminded neighbors in Brooklyn to check for anything strange or out of place. Maybe it's time to invest in a ring camera to see, make sure I know what's going on in my yard all the time. It never occurred to me. This is the Columbus neighborhood where Darnell Taylor's body was found. Set up the barriers so to not see but because of where my bedroom is, we could see that it was not um, an adult. So it was pretty hard. Investigators were led here after interviewing May and developing some information that Darnell's body could have been left in a sewage drain. We will be in consultation with the prosecutor's office to add murder to Mrs. May charges and to begin the process of transporting her back to Franklin County. It's really horrible to hear about the, the child. Um, he was so adorable. In Brooklyn, Tessa DiTiro, News 5.